Hello and welcome to another Pulse Fired Gaming video. My name is Brandon and this is a proxy for the Mandator class battlecruiser suitable for games like Star Wars Armada. The actual model is named the MC-83 by the sculptor Utar Games and Designs. This ship measures over 227 millimeters in length and as you can see is available in both Spicy Pickle and Spicy Pickle with Wings. After publishing the Allegiance class battlecruiser listing on Etsy, we felt that the New Republic needed a counterpart to even the odds. We will have a link to the Wikipedia entry as well as a link to kdyards.com for a sample ship card to field the ship in Star Wars Armada as a homebrew ship. Now here's some lore on the Mediator from Wikipedia. The Mediator class was over half the size of the prototype Viscount class Star Defender and was a successor to the previous generations of Star Cruisers, including the MC-80 Home 1 type, itself at one point the largest warship in the Rebel fleet. Like previous Mon Calamari cruisers, they were heavily but conventionally armed with turbolasers and ion cannons, defensive shields, heavy armor, tractor beam projectors, and squadrons of starfighters. Little is known about their overall layout, but one of the ship's main hangar bays had an opening on the ventral side of the hull. The armor inside the ship was strong enough to prevent complete destruction of the vessel even in the case of a nuclear detonation inside the hangar. The Mediator class played an important role in the Yuzhan Vong War. These ships along with the larger Viscount class were designed after the Black Fleet Crisis as more powerful successors to the previous classes of star cruisers built by the Mon Calamari shipyards. The class also represented a move away from the alphanumeric designations which had been given to previous Mon Cal ship types such as the MC-80 and the MC-90. Instead, they used a conventional class name based on the name of the lead ship, the Mediator. The new battlecruisers were introduced during a conflict prior to the Yuzhan Vong War and was saw service in the opening months of the Galactic Invasion. The class's namesake, the Mediator, can be considered the first major combat casualty of the conflict. While she was deployed to intervene in a dispute between the planets Romamul and Osarian, enemy infiltrator Nam Anor detonated a shuttle laden with nuclear explosives in the hangar, severely damaging the ship. In the first months of the war, military analysts like Adar Nailakirka, the New Republic's head of fleet intelligence, believed that the Mediator class ships already in service, when used in conjunction with both in assault cruisers and star defenders, were sufficient to engage the Yuzhan Vong successfully. A Mediator class ship was the centerpiece of a battle group of New Republic and Imperial Revenant warships deployed at Ord Mantel in early 26 ABY in anticipation of a Yuzan Vong strike there. However, during the Battle of Ord Mantel, this ship was destroyed after a vicious close combat engagement with several enemy vessels, including a Mid Roik, which is an ISD sized Yuzan Vong warship. Not much is known about them after this event. Although Mon Calamari was believed to have been cut off before the end of the first year of the war, it appears that secret hyperlanes were in fact kept open and that new ships continued to be supplied to the New Republic fleets, including the Mediator class. A number of Mediator class ships were part of the combined Alliance fleet guarding Mon Calamari and its shipyards in 29 ABY. The ships served under Admiral Trest Cafe during the defense of Mon Calamari and were part of the final assault of the war during the Battle of Yuzantar. We want to thank Utar Games and Designs for partnering with us for commercial prints. If you want to support our channel, you can like our videos, leave us feedback in the comment section, and subscribe for future videos. If you're feeling extra, visit us on Etsy and buy a copy of these fantastic ships. Thank you for watching and have a great day.